Hello again, and welcome back to Simple Science. Today's project is entitled Fun with Convection. Convection is the movement caused within a fluid, in this case air, by the tendency of hotter and therefore less dense material to rise, and cooler, denser material to sink under the influence of gravity, which consequently results in a transfer of heat. Now for the supplies you'll need to complete this project. First, a wire coat hanger, a paper plate, a sharp pin, a roll of tape, a pair of scissors, and lastly, a pen. All right, let's get building. First, carefully bend the coat hanger into the shape shown. This will be the base of your project. Bend the hooked part at the top of the hanger straight. Unroll a strip of tape about an inch and a half long from the roll of tape. Cut this strip off with your scissors. Lay the pin on the sticky side of the tape. Attach it to the top of the coat hanger and continue to wrap the strip of tape tightly around the pin and coat hanger wire. Put this assembly aside and using your scissors, cut the rim off of the paper plate so you end up with a disc about six inches across. Using your pen, draw a circle about the size of a dime as close to the middle of the paper plate as you can. Next, draw a spiral starting from the outside edge and continuing to the circle you drew at the center. Try to keep each section between the lines of the spiral close to the same size. Using your scissors, Cut carefully along the line you just drew. You should end up with a spiral that looks like this. Carefully balance the paper spiral on top of the pin. Make sure that the spiral does not touch the coat hanger at any point. If your spiral hangs down too low and touches the base, no problem. Just snip off some of the bottom of the spiral to shorten it. And that's it. Here is what your project should look like at this point. Note that it is sitting on top of a lampshade. Why could this be? The lamp, with an incandescent bulb, will act as a heat source, warming the air around the bulb. Turn on the lamp and wait a minute or two. Air heated by the bulb becomes less dense and rises. This rising air impacts the bottom surface of the spiral, causing it to slip sideways and rotate. The rising warm air produces a vacuum that draws more cool air into the area around the bulb. This air is then heated, and the cycle continues. Well, thank you for joining us in this week's episode of Simple Science. We hope you had fun with this week's project. And we hope we'll see you again next week.